it is Manchester United 2, Leeds United 2. Manchester United drawing against Leeds in the Rose Derby after going two goals nil against Leeds. And then coming back to getting that point where we just thought that, oh, we could have just ensured we get a victory. Three points that were needed today to get ahead of or catch up to Manchester City. But no, 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 on a Wednesday night, Manchester United decided to just flop. Letting us down, but we couldn't be more proud of the comeback. Because the comeback is what was needed. And I was hella stressed when we was 2 0 down. I'm sure you guys was as well. Today was one of the weirdest get days today because it really showed not having Casemiro and Ericsson in midfield really, really damages Manchester United. And it just shows that we need them. And we really miss them because we lost out on in the midfield battle. And that's where we lost out throughout the whole game. Especially. The fact that in the first goal, in the first 45 minutes in that first half, Nato, the Italian, breaking through the first press and the second press and the third press. And you just knew that if Casemiro was there, he would have knocked the shit out of him and grabbed him by his neck and threw him outside, bro. Like it was wrestling. But yet, it didn't. Nato's getting that first early goal in the first minute, you know. In that first minute, and he was like, what the fuck is this minute? I didn't even get to drink, or blink, or do anything. I didn't even get to sit down. And then we just conceded. And then it was half-time Manchester United, nil, Leeds won, and we were thinking, we better turn up in the second half. Because we all believed that Manchester United, we'll come back, we'll come back, we'll come back. But guess what? We concede the second goal by an own goal by from Raphael Varane. Somerville doing Somerville things. Summary things in the side, trying to cross it in, and then of course deflecting off of Rafael Varane. Nothing he could have done, nothing he could have done. And I can see it there, in Manchester United, a game over. Uh, two, they could have been two uh, at least level of points with Man City today, but they flopped. But yes, that's making it two goals to nil for Leeds. We were suffering, and then finally, 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 Manchester United making changes. Putting Rashford on the on the on the left hand side, and taking off Ganacho, taking off Fuegos, um, bringing on Sancho, and also Pelestri, which was needed because Ganacho was playing shit. He was shit throughout. Yes, from the first forty five minutes and everything, even the second goal was kind of his fault. But yeah. Oh, the cross from Dalo, the wonderful play of Manchester United for Rashford to get that jumping, wanting it even more and making it 2-1 for Manchester United. Big up Rashford who continues to score in the fantasy team now, baby. And of course, Manchester United equalising Jaden Sancho for homecoming for the Premier League, you know, getting that equaliser, the play as well. And of course, with Shaw and the ball deflecting and everything, Jaden Sancho able to finish it off 2-2 was thinking come on get that one more goal we'll get that one more goal we had chances but it wasn't meant to be for Manchester United unfortunately it ended up with the game being 2-2 today player wise today I thought that Rashford was good today in the second half but in the 45 minutes he just couldn't get going Garnacho was shit bro from the start, his first touches, his passing, giving the ball away so many times, he's been terrible. Sancho came on to get that goal, and that big up to him. Sabitzer was average. Fred was terrible as well, giving the ball away. Workhurst wasn't found at all, and they were not even crossing the ball to someone that was that, was that high. Seriously, but apart from that, we wasn't we wasn't the best. These were better, especially with the with the pressing. We created a lot of chances, but Leeds were better. But we, we deserve to get a draw after what we've done. It is what it is with Manchester United fans. Manchester United getting those points. And we play them again. And we hopefully we should get these three points and show them in front of their fans. But it has been your match reaction from your boy, Avril and Spice. Let me know who your, who your man of the match is as well. Because my man of the match has to be nobody. But don't hear the match. Definitely Gert Nacho. Shit, guy. And as always, guys, let me know who your dog here the match is. And let me know your thoughts in the comments. Till next time, remember to keep it united. And remember to keep it ready now because your boy's out. He's tired. I, I couldn't believe we drew, man. Anyway, guys, peace, peace, peace.